Good morning, Okie Dokie Explorers. This is Steve White in Adventure One. If you will notice, the little dot in front of you is Catherine in Adventure Two. And we are going adventuring this morning. And we are leaving the house with the intention of getting her car stuck. Seems like a, not a very smart thing to do, but we have some extrication gear that we wanted to test, and we also wanted to test her new tires, the BF Goodrich Trail Trays on Adventure 2. So, buckle up as we go out here and get stuck. And enjoy a beautiful Oklahoma morning. Okay, okie dokie explorers. We're all in adventure two now. This is Catherine. She's driving. There's our known sand trap up here. And we're going to try and get through it. Remember, momentum is your friend, but we don't want surely momentum. Oh. Yay! Okay. All right. Got through that fairly easily. Yeah. But like I was telling the camera earlier, I have never gotten stuck so far, so. Well, we're going to make it our mission today. Yeah. Yay. Make it our mission today. Go back and get the truck. Yes. Okay. And then I'll probably park there where we turned around. Okay, that works. And then that way we don't have so far of a walk. When you do get stuck. Okay. And or you can't get unstuck with GoTreads. Right. GoTreads is not a sponsor of this video because we have no sponsors. <laughs> and if you would like to sponsor Okie Dokie Explorers, then feel free to go ahead and contact us. Send and us an email. Send us an email. Alright. There's Adventure 2. Or Adventure 1. We're in Adventure 2. We're in Adventure 2. Alright. I will try and get out of the sand That's bird. That's Okie, this is Doki. Ah, <laughs> That's good. We might need to keep that. All right, there's your camera back. All righty, thank you. Also on this morning's adventure is we? Baby Explorer. It's we? We. She is we. She is we? Okay. We, we. We, we? Yes. All right. Oh, I didn't grab my gloves. Uh-oh. Oh, well. I'm glad they could dig us a nice sand trench like this. Right? Okay, Whitney. Go back. I got through that. You did. Um, Let's go back and get the truck. All right. All right, Catherine. How are you feeling about this next stretch? Uh, this is usually the part that's bad. So this is I usually have, the part that's bad. I don't have a very good run. Oh, 
it's not as bad as it's been. It's but a longer stretch. It is a longer stretch. So far, these little tires are being phenomenal. Yep. Our traction control's not kicking our ass anymore. Okay. okay. Let's turn around down here in this little wide spot. Okay. Is there a turnout? They're right there. I think there's a gate up here. stuck this time. Okay. Try and get it stuck so that I can get past you and not drive all the way around two sections. Alright, well, we'll see what I can do. Okay. My tow hooks are on the front, aren't they? No, you got a tow hook on the back. On the back. Okay. Alright. How would I get stuck? Uh, just stopping in this extra high pile here. Seems oh like... Oh my gosh, it's What do you say? <laughs> All right, let's see if we can't get some go treads. All right. So I'm not buried bad. You're not buried bad. Not as bad as I've helped people get unburied from. Yep. Whenever they panicked. Here are our new go treads. As previously discussed, not a sponsor. This is what you get. Hi. 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 Get going again with go treads. These are a Wichita company. And there is no QR. There is a QR code if you would like to contact them. GoTreads.com. GoTreads.com. Step one, put the vehicle in park and set the emergency brake. Before using GoTreads, did you set the emergency brake? You did not. No. Okay. With the smooth surface down, unfold the GoTreads and center the short section as close to the stuck tire as GoTreads. I'm sorry, as possible. Keep in mind that you want to drive up the go treads so that you need to align them in the path of the stuck tire. Release the brake as you begin moving forward, slowly accelerate to gain some speed. Drive out and go to a safe place before stopping to retrieve your go treads. I'm saying going down there and parking where Oki is. Yep. Go treads double as a vehicle leveling block. Oh. Haha. <laughs> they oh, put a little awesome. They put a little card in there. Okay. I'm going to say we try it without digging any. Without digging at all. Okay. No digging. No digging. And the cool thing is these are warranted for life. If you get one panel damage, they can just send you one panel as opposed to an entire four foot stretch. Yeah. Like, so you can take the little pins out. You can take the little pins out. And just change out the one panel. And change out the one panel if you get it ruined. It is supposed to be phenomenal on things that can go into the individual treads of the go treads. Things like gravel and rocks liable to not be good and liable to cause you some dings. Thank you. Oh, you just threw all that sand in the back of your car. Well, it's got rubber. It does. Okay. Go do your driver wheel first. Alright. Smooth side down. Right? Right. Right. So it can suck it under there. It sucks it underneath there. Remember, this is no shoveling. No That's shoveling. Straight. Is that straight? That looks pretty straight to me. I think it'll suck it right up in there. Okay. How you doing? What's up? Okay, Is that your water? You Stay there. Do. If you are... Oh, look at the little bird treads. Or lizard treads. Yeah. Catherine, what are some other things that you can do in order to increase 
your traction in sand? Um, like besides have go treads or something? Besides have go treads. Well, you can always like pull some of the shrubbery out of the uh, bar ditch. Yeah. Like here's a dead log. That would be fantastic for pulling apart and putting under the tires to get you some traction just to go. Say if you had nothing else out here, what could you do to increase your traction? Um, I don't know. What do all of the other overlanders do before they get onto a trail? Uh, let down their tire pressure. More traction? I could probably let some air out and get some more traction. Okay. It wouldn't make me comfortable because I don't have another way to air, air up, up my tires. But you would not be stuck and you could drive slowly to go to wherever you need to go. Alright, why don't you jump into your car. Hello, baby. And I'm going to stand out here. And watch how they work. And watch how they work. Alright. And stop. I slid off, didn't I? They kind of pulled sideways. They worked amazingly, though. Alright. You want to hold the camera? While I go reload for a second go around? Second go around? Second okay. go around. There we go. All right, we were out, but I didn't want to roll over the go tread after it had gotten wadded up underneath the front tire. Slow and easy. There. Okay, go, 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 go. Keep digging, little car. Keep digging. Nope. Okay, here we are on go three. Try and getting some momentum and get out of here. And just like that. This is what your go treads look like after they're folded up. And we're out. All right, so the go treads worked amazing. I think that they were better for an individual. I think that Catherine could have put them underneath the front of her tires. There was no digging. There was no muss, no fuss. You just shove them up under there where the flat spot goes underneath the tire and then get back in and slowly drive up them and then get some momentum to get out of whatever it is that you're in. I can't wait to see what they look like on snow. I think right. snow is going to be absolutely phenomenal too. There's just minor, minor blemishing to the fronts of some of the ones where the tire spin gets onto it. There's just a little bit of where it got hot as you were getting up and over the, the hump of whatever you're stuck in. There is maybe just a little bit right here. But it's for really the, just dirt. But for the overall gist of everything, it is it is basically like we pulled it out of the out of the box yeah or bag whatever yeah so you can tell it got just a little bit hot right there right where and the tire some, was rubbing there's some tire rub right there but i can pry it off with my fingernail it's not the board is not damaged the board is not damaged the car also folded up the passenger side and it rolled over it folded Sweet. and that was part of why we didn't go for the first get around was i didn't want to wad it up underneath the front tire and then roll over it with the back tire but right it took it it's got enough hinge here and to, if they can be used as leveling then they should be fine with my car rolling over the top right. of it my main thing is i just wouldn't want it to like slow down my momentum but it didn't i didn't even feel it yeah the uh driver side was exactly like it was Mommy's sand so fantastic. Yeah, mommy's car needed vacuumed anyway. It's fine. It did. But I think I think go treads are a way to go. Yeah, I am I am glad we spent the money on this. This is worth it. And you are awesome, go treads. Look for future videos of us getting this vehicle stuck and possibly using the Factor 55 kinetic rope.
because we have a recovery point right there. Right there. Not in front. Not in front. Not in front. But um, support your local communities. Um, it's Midwest built and American made. So GoTreads.com. Uh, they come in different colors. They had tactical black. I believe they had a blue one. Mm -hmm, like your shirt. Like my shirt. And we also went with OSU orange. <laughs> Go Pokes. Go Pokes. <laughs> so, anyways, obviously not affiliated with OSU. <laughs> obviously not affiliated with OSU. Calm down, OSU. Calm down. They are blaze orange for easy retrieval and recovery, just like every other. I, I like blaze board. orange. Anyway, so remember, remember Okie Dokie Explorers, just go and have adventures. This was fun. This was fun. All right, you ready to get back out of here? I think so. You want to turn around here and try and make it all the way again? Yeah, I okay. bet I can. All right, we'll go up that way. All right.